Uh, welcome to the Eleven Things Church. My name is Alex Schneider, along with my co-host. As usual, it's Paul Hippie. And we're just going to do the series wrap-up of the Phillies and the season preview of the Pirates. Um, my start for the, the wrap-up, anyway, is uh, two words, basically. Mike Leake. I don't know what's wrong with him. He didn't get a loss last night, but it was not looking very promising for a while. Um he just needs to be better. Yeah, um, that contract is uh, right now not paying off. Um, you have to think he'll pull it together at some point. Uh, but at the same time, man, it'd be nice to see him get a couple quality starts here and there. At least go into like the sixth, seventh inning. That'd be nice to see. <clears throat> um, so basically what I have for the uh, injuries for um, the Pirates is I don't know any updates on – uh, Jung Ho Kong, but he's got to be coming back soon. I think right? end of April, beginning of May, sometime in May, I would assume so. That's what I had read before the season started, but I'm not sure. Let's say he should be coming back soon if he's not back already. I don't pay attention to the Pirates because I'm a Cardinal fan and I could care less about the Pirates. Um, so, yeah, I mean, that's about your injury report. Um, for the injuries for the Cardinals, uh, Tommy Pham actually went on a rehab assignment on uh, May fourth. Um, I didn't see how long he would be on that re- on that rehab assignment, but my guess would be maybe a week, week and a half. Um, but other than that, yeah, at least someone's getting healthy. Um, and then just to hint at something, uh, I think in the podcast, I want I want to do a little conversation about who we think should be sent down if Pham comes back up. Um, or I have a pretty crazy kind of request or whatever I think is going to happen. So pay attention in the podcast and you'll see that. <clears throat> um, for the who's hot for the Pirates, Josh Harrison's batting 320 for the season. Um, if who's hot for the Cardinals, I'm going to say Matt Adams. At least, you know, for the Phillies, there's not really – hasn't been one guy that sort of carried the load. Uh, one game was a home run derby. Uh, one game the Cardinals couldn't get anything together against Aaron Nola. Um, but I'm going to go Matt Adams. He's, he's been three for nine uh, th- through the first three games of the series with uh, one home run and a couple of RBIs. Um, so, yeah, that, that's about it on that front. Uh, who's not hot, actually, is Andrew McCutcheon. He's betting 229, like a hundred, over 100 less than Josh Harrison, which is very surprising. Uh, who's not hot for the Cardinals? Uh, we already mentioned it, but uh, Mike Leake, uh, through the start uh, against the Phillies, he's been uh, – throwing a uh, 6.03 ERA. Uh, he has not won a game. He's 0-3, and he has a 1.34 whip. So if he's on your fantasy team, like he's on your team, uh, you're probably not too pleased about him right now. No. Um, I, if I have one thing to say during – to look forward to um, – Oh, man, I forgot to mention the uh, starting pitchers. My fault. I apologize to everybody. Um, man, the starting you're killing pitchers. the vibe. You're killing the vibe. Dude, I just, I just saw it. Uh, my apologies, guys. Uh, the starting pitching for the Pirates for this series is Francisco Liriano, Jeff Locke, and Garrett Cole. Uh, for the Cardinals, we have Carlos Martinez, Adam Wainwright, and Michael Locke. Those are going to be some good pitching matchups. That's a pretty that's a pretty stellar weekend that, to look forward to, to be honest with you. I'm like, again, apologize for that. Um, but – I would say the series look for this one. I would go, man. I don't know. I'm actually going to go with the Pirates win the series two to one. Um, I'm going to say the Cardinals win the series two to one because we've seen this trend over the last couple of years. When the Cardinals are in Pittsburgh, they tend to suck. Uh, they don't win much in Pittsburgh. But when the Pirates come here to St. Louis, they tend to suck, uh, and they don't play too well here. So I'm going to go Cardinals two to one, uh, but. You know, if the Pirates won the series, I can't say I'd be surprised given the way the Cardinals are playing. Exactly. There are a lot of inconsistencies, and we'll touch on that in the podcast. But uh, thank you guys for tuning in to uh, the series wrap-up and season preview. Again, my apologies on the starting pitchers. Um, We're trying not to make those mistakes again. Um, But thank you guys very much. Uh, And watch out for the podcast. We'll be uh, doing that very soon. Um, And thank you guys, and have a good day.